It's planting season, and Northeastland roots are planting with purpose. To bring fresh produce into the neighborhood for folks that can't access it otherwise. Maria Livers is the group's executive director. Beautiful. The mission started when founder Doug Fawcett saw a farm for sale in Richfield Township four years ago. I wanted to save it, so I came up with a concept of purchasing this and turning it into a farm where we could grow fruits, vegetables, and things like that to bring into the inner city to people that don't have readily available produce. But the farm was only the first step. Shortly after working out an arrangement with the owners, Fawcett came across another property that would become vital to his mission. An opportunity came up to buy a greenhouse in the inner city in the Clark Fulton neighborhood, and that area is a complete food desert. The timing was just too perfect. I feel like there's no such thing as coincidence. While they work to get a storefront open, people living nearby can still grow their own food. Tucked behind the greenhouse on West 41st and Robert Avenue are 20 community garden beds. All you have to do is fill out an application. The folks commit to the whole season and they are responsible for growing, tending, watering, and harvesting. And maybe pay it forward. And if they have extra, uh, they'll share it with others. Francois lives in the neighborhood and now tends to one of these garden beds after saying a simple hello to a new neighbor. No, because I'm a neighbor, so I saw them coming and they're talking to them. They told me what they want to be doing. And Cleveland Roots is also spreading the seeds of good nutrition, partnering with organizations like the U.S. Committee for Refugees and Immigrants to help fill farmers markets across Cleveland. We raise seedlings all together here, and then we each take our seedlings out to different gardens. So as they plant the seeds of change... They like each other. It's all good. They're also planting roots in the Clark Fulton community. You know, when a building like this becomes available and there's an existing need, the fact that we can address it is, is then our obligation. That was Frank Wiley reporting, and Frank tells us Cleveland Roots is expected to open its storefront in the Clark Fulton neighborhood in early July. It also offers a lot of educational opportunities for anyone interested in learning how to grow their own food. We've got all the information for you on our News 5 app.